Hello Lilas, welcome back to my channel guys. Thanks for being a subscriber and if you're not a subscriber, go ahead and click the subscribe button. Click the bell to be a part of the notification squad and don't forget to join my paid channel membership which is the chatterbox. The link is in the description bar or on my about me tab. It is $1.99 to join and you do have to be at least 18 years old. Today I am showing Prototype Taya, sculpted by Erica Lee, and you can find her on Facebook and Instagram. And so, Taya is a silicone cuddle, cuddle baby head, um, which is sold by the sculptor. I believe the heads are um, still available. Well, I know they are, they're still available. You just have to contact her. And the mouth is sculpted closed, but you can have her open the mouth. So my Taya has the mouth open so that he could receive a pacifier. I originally started out with Taya as a girl, but once I got almost done with Taya, um, his mommy, said that she would like him as a boy so I went ahead and made that adjustment for her which I think was the best idea because I really like this baby as a boy like and he he is just so cute um as a boy I just really think he's really really nice as a boy so um I finished rooting him completely he's getting ready to go home um he is on a newborn Reggie Ann's body. I had custom done. So he actually have um, the little gathers in his chest. He has a bum bum with the little gathers in, in the bum bum. And he also can, let's see if he can do it with these mitts on. He can put his hands together. Um, you might not, can't tell it as much in with this but he can he can put his hands together because he got magnets in his hands so that they stick together so he can hold his hands together or whatever rather you want to do it as a clapping <laughs> praying babies like to keep their hands in their face a lot when they're little type thing so um yeah i have adjusted his weight a little bit and he has a heartbeat <laughs> i was gonna keep that a secret for mommy to discover um but i won't get to have him to be in a video sorry i'm wiping that off he had uh, a pacifier and i got a little bit of a ky he has a somewhat of a small mouth so it's very important that you use a ky when you put the pacifier in he can take pacifiers with small nipper, nipples like newborn nipples he uh just had this pacifier in um i will upload some photos on instagram so that you guys can see him more um his hair is um wavy to curly um a lot of more curls you know in the top of his head and you know around the sides like baby's hair tend to to lay a little bit more that's how I did his hair. Let's see if you can turn it this way. And you can kind of get... It's kind of hard to to see, but... uh, I don't know. It's kind of hard to see. And then when the light shine right there where the center part is, it make it look like, like he got a bald spot almost. But he doesn't. Let me see. He has a full head of hair. Trust me. <laughs> um... But yeah, so this kit to me, it I keep saying it and hopefully it doesn't annoy people when I say this, but he just give me such, like he can definitely be a really cute Asian-like baby. So I think it's like, he can be like Blasian, <laughs> black mixed with Asian. <laughs> I don't know, um, but he can be whatever you want to be, but he's definitely AA. Um, skin tone our babies are definitely the skin tone can be the skin tone um newborn or whatever of course you know we come in all different shades but 
yeah um i just i think he's really really cute he has decent ears you know decent sculpted ears and stuff and he has the cutest little nose so very very excited to for mommy to get him and hopefully she love him and enjoy him just as much in person um i definitely um want want him to be a very special addition for her um so it's really exciting i think well this she she has more than one of my babies she's had more than one of my babies in her collection before so but not silicone so it'll be pretty cool so he is getting packed up and yeah he's getting packed up oh my goodness you know the packing part is my hardest part because everybody does such beautiful presentations and all these bows and wraps and all that stuff and i'm pretty like okay let me wrap the baby secure in the blankie you know i'll put the little goodies in the baggie and voila that's it for me like i don't know how i do all the fancy but i'm gonna try to <laughs> keep trying to get better at it but anyway um, I think the best part usually for me be the baby, so we're going to give it a shot, give it a go. Let me see if I take him off of this tripod. Because it's kind of hard, I don't know, it's kind of hard to to really get an idea of him. Like, I, I love, 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 love. I don't know. I just, something about this baby I, I really like. I don't know what it is, but once he got done, and especially as a boy, y'all know I'm a boy mom, so that really, I was like, oh my gosh. So I I had fun going to shop for him little clothing and stuff like that. So I already had these shoes here, and I was like, ah, I'm not sending my shoes, but I think it fits so cute with the outfit. So, um... I think you guys probably would agree with me that I should send the shoes versus I was going to put him on some, I could put him on some brown socks, but I think the shoes look cuter. I don't know about you guys, but I mean, I think the shoes look cute. So yeah, I will leave the link in the description bar um, to Erica Lee's facebook page so that if you guys are interested in getting a black uh, black <laughs> oh my gosh what's wrong with me if you guys are interested in getting a blank scope from her kit cuddle head from her um you'll be able to know exactly where to go and um and so you can check her out not just for Taya, but she has other sculpts, full bodies and cloth bodies and other cuddle heads. So um, she does have a variety of different sculpts um, between her and her mom, which is Jamie Lynn Powers. So they kind of work really closely together. So there you have it. So I don't want to make this video too long. I am as you know very very busy now i'm gonna be like focus 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 all on greta 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 so the next prototype greta will be ready hopefully at least the painting um soon and i will do that reveal for you guys and then of course you guys know i have a birthday baby i want to show you guys and just so on and so forth i am so excited i haven't like been this excited in so long like about just being a collector being an artist like it's so much easier when i can just paint and just go um even though um i've had like a few little projects like side projects like private orders um behind the scene here and there um i haven't been overly like overwhelmed or stressed because i only take like maybe one at a time and usually not by fussy collectors so it's made it so much easier for me i'm just so excited ah! um i don't know 
Uh, I'm excited about my collection, my personal collection. I'm excited about, you know, learning more, getting to paint more, to, you know, practice different techniques. I'm excited about how um, Taya came out. I am going to say that this sculpt look nothing like this as a blank and i'm so excited like the transformation is so amazing um so I, and i want to say this before i go i always make my videos super long and i say i want to make it short but i want to say this before i go sometimes we don't really see the full potential of a kit when it's blank can we all agree on that it's like when you see it sculpted it makes such a big difference not sculpted lord paint it it makes such a big difference and then even sometimes for me i have to really put the baby together sometimes they, they need their hair um it just depends and it's like oh my gosh this is so different than what i thought and i never know which way in which direction the baby's gonna go but again i thank every sculptor that have given me the opportunity in this case i i, I am very thankful that uh erica lee asked me to do the prototype for this baby and it was fun working on this baby um, I feel like I was able to do a little different paint uh, style on this baby than a lot of my previous babies um, I think him and Nobi kind of had a similar technique and I, I was really excited to do that so um, yeah I'm humbly grateful for the prototype offers that I get Especially with, well, with silicone mostly. Um, not too much with uh, vinyl prototypes because I don't root my own vinyl and most artists want rooted, a fully rooted baby and everything for their pictures and all that and stuff. And I can understand that. I'm very dependent on my rooter when it comes to that type stuff. So, um, but with silicone, I can root my own babies so I can complete the whole package. So I'm always open to a silicone prototype versus a vinyl so i've been enjoying a couple of projects i got a couple more in the works um we'll see if they all come through and i hope you guys just keep following me throughout my journey in this hobby and art and community and i appreciate all of you guys support and cheering me on but yes i am so happy team I know his name. I don't know if his mom will let me say his name. I'm not gonna say his name, but he has a, such a cute name. She actually took one of the names from my suggestion list of names for my baby. Um, in the chatterbox, we were doing a thing and my mom came in and, and named uh, Tariq. And she used one of those names that somebody suggested. So that's gonna be cool. So once she gets the baby and do the reveal, I might come back and revisit and, and we can share that part or even in the chat about maybe she'll come in and join with us with the baby. So, ah, I'm so excited. All right. Thanks guys. Talk to you guys later. Bye-bye.